Hello, good morning, and thank you for watching this video. Today I'm going to do an updated video on how to make honey. Um, so, we now have a new mod, which is the beekeeping mod. How very interesting indeed. Now, let me show it to you. So we need to pop this down. It costs 95,000 to purchase. Um, actually, I'm going to put it next to my existing bees. So you can have a look at it. Oh, I thought it, I own that land. Okay, I don't. Let's pop it here then. Um, so I have filmed before. One of my first ever videos was on how to make honey. Uh, with the traditional beehives and then you've got here a spawn point and then of course all the different mods which are available to you but this has now come out the beekeeping mod let me show you how this works so we uh we do have work to do if we want to produce honey we have work to do i might i'm i can't answer why this list is so long the recipe is exactly the same every single time so I, I I don't actually have an answer for you there um, so we'll turn one on maybe maybe we turn them all on we'll do it a little test but to make honey you need a thousand uh, sorry a hundred liters of empty pallets a hundred liters of empty barrels and then that produces you the honey so, if you're not into forestry, this probably isn't the mod for you, and you can just go down the traditional route of the beehives and the, the, the spawn point, because you literally have to do nothing to get that production. All you do is pick up the honey and you're good to go. What would be good about this is that you would be able to turn this to distributing. So this could go to your cereal um, factories, for example. Whereas with this, you do have to keep on coming and picking it up and distributing it yourself. So that's the only difference, which I would see would be a big plus. Um, so now I have, again, I have actually made a video on how to make um, pallets um i'll do a video separately on how to make barrels but it's pretty much the same thing um but what i'll do is i'll go over to the my wood area get that on the go and i will see you in a minute right, guys uh so i went to go and cut some trees down uh, in front of you here is the sawmill mod i will take um screenshots of the mods i'll put them at the end of the video so that you can have a look so what this sawmill does is it creates planks which is what i'm holding in my forklift right now it creates planks and beams directly from wood um if you're not into forestry this um way of making honey is probably not for you uh but if you are this these two mods are definitely the ones to download so this is the sawmill um, I will make sure you get all the information at the end and you just go to productions and factories to place I believe it's hundred and ten thousand to place it and then this um, factory in front of me is the pallet and barrel mod so these are beams, popping them in, there we go. So this is the pallet and barrel production. Absolutely fantastic. And here we go. Here are our first barrels. I'm gonna have another one pop out in just a second. There we go, love it. Um, let me show you how we do this. So make sure both of these are active, okay. Um, I've got these to storing, but now we could actually have these set to distributing because that will go straight over to our honey, uh, our beekeeper. 
Um, of course, if these are needed in any other chains, they will distribute to those. You have no control over where they're distributed to. When you click distributing, it distributes evenly to all the places where they're needed. And that's, that's just your lot. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to load these up and we're going to take them back over to the beekeeping. Um, put them in and see how long it takes to make the honey. Uh, this is actually the first time I'm using this beekeeping mod, so you are seeing this as I am seeing this. Um, I was a little disappointed that the barrels come in a, in a box, the barrel comes in a box with the barrel sticker on. It's like, I, I actually want to see the barrels. Um, but turns out it wasn't meant to be, guys. Uh, so instead of you sitting here watching me crash into buildings and very poorly load up this trailer, um, I will see you back at the beekeeping mod. See you in a moment. Okay, so I have the pallet. Um, pallets, I should say. I've got two pallets of barrels, three pallets of um, empty pallets. <laughs> Uh, let's pop them in, shall we? I actually didn't do too much of a bad job stacking these, um, all things considered. It's just the pressure of being on the camera sometimes. I, I make the, the worst... I sometimes just bash into everything. Okay, here we go. Let's get this, uh, let's get this beekeeping on, underway. In fact, well, if I drive straight into the trigger, will it automatically unload for me? Let's find out. If I pull that up, yep. Okay, let's spin this round. Maybe it'll... Oh, let's fasten. We might be able to do this quicker. Going to automatically unload? Yes, you are. You beauty. We're happy about that. So I don't know where these spawn. Um, oh, you know what? I'm wondering whether all of the the honey, um, honey, 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 honey list. I think I know what this is now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. I reckon it's these. One two three four five six seven eight ah okay so you can have all of these running so it's related to these uh interesting okay i did not really i did not resonate with that at all um but now i can hear a lot of buzzing 17 liters so we are the world is our oyster. Let's have a look at the recipe. I can't remember. Okay, so yes, 100 to 100 to 1,000 litres. That's really good. So that's not a substantial amount of empty pallets and empty barrels that you would need to produce. And that kind of makes sense, right? Because why, why would you need that much wood? Um, it is literally just going to be... Do you think this is the spawn point? Or are we picking up as a fluid? That's a fluid point, isn't it? I'm, I'm really intrigued to see what happens here, um, whether it we pick it up as a liquid. But my assumption is if we're putting in pallets, surely, surely we're gonna have a spawn point. Um, so this isn't going too fast. It is more impressive than I thought it was going to be. Um, but what I'm going to do is I am going to come back once we've got our first 1,000 litres. Um, I'm just going to go and pick up uh, some of the produce around the farm because I've got a lot to do. And I'll be back with you once we have something to show. See you in a moment. Hello everybody, I've been busy around my farm, so I've only just got back um, and we have a spawned um, 
pallet of honey. So it does spawn in front. I'm not. Sh I'm still not sure what this trigger is for here. Maybe we can bring um, a uh, a tanker here and load up as a liquid. I'm not sure. But yeah, there it is. There's our first one. Uh, and then we can just pick this up and take it away. I'm actually going to switch this now to distributing uh, so that it goes straight to the places that I want it to go to. Um, there we go. And then I don't need to worry about it ever again. Well, I hope you found this video useful. Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please give me a like. Don't forget to subscribe. And most of all, have a wonderful day.